Hi everyone, this is Ashish. I'm a junior doctor working in the UK. In today's video, we will talk about dermatology training in the UK. This is a much requested video from all of you. So in this video, I will discuss the training pathway. We will discuss the duration of the pathway. We'll discuss the salaries of dermatologists in the UK and we will talk about the competition ratios. So if you are someone who's interested in dermatology training, then this is the video for you. Also, if you haven't yet, please subscribe to this channel, like this video, share this video with your friends, your colleagues, and let's start with this video. So what is the duration of dermatology's training in the UK? After internship, you need to train for eight years to become a fully qualified consultant to work in the NHS in the UK. After internship, what you need to do is you need to get F2 competencies. To get F2 competencies, you can either go for the foundation program, which is for two years and get foundation competencies, or you can work as an on-training job and you can get your crest form sign or you can apply for a standalone F52 and after completion of that, you will get your F2 competency signed. Now, after getting your foundation competencies, there are four types of pathways. The standard ones is getting into IMT, which is internal medicine training, and this is for two years. And once you complete MRCP, you can apply for higher training in dermatology, that is ST3. The next pathway is applying for ACCS, that is acute care common STEM in internal medicine and getting your MRCP and this pathway is for three years. And once you pass your MRCP, you can apply for ST3 in dermatology. There are also two alternate pathways. So after you satisfactorily complete three years of level one pediatrics training with full MRCPCH or two years of course surgical training plus full MRCS plus achievement of IM year two capabilities, you can apply for dermatology training at ST3 level. Also, after satisfactory completion of three years of level one pediatric training program with full MRCPCH or two years of course surgical training with full MRCS plus 12 months of experience in medical specialties in a range of acute hospital medical specialties that admit acutely unwell patients and manage their immediate follow-ups, you can apply for ST3 in dermatology. Remember that dermatology is not a direct training pathway. So you'll have to go for some kind of core training and then you can apply for dermatology as a specialty training. This is the full pathway for dermatology. So you get your foundation competency signed, then you do your core training, which can be for two years or three years, depending on what kind of pathway you're going on for. After that, you complete your MRCP. You can do that before applying for the core training, or you can do this during your core training. And after you've finished your core training and your MRCP, you will have to go for interviews. And once you have performed well in those interviews, you will get a position as a trainee in dermatology at ST3 level. After that, you'll have to train for four years and then pass this exam that is called SCE, that is called, that is Specialty Certificate Examination in Dermatology. And once you have done all of that, you can become a consultant dermatologist in the UK. The competition ratios for dermatology are as follows. So for 2021, it was 5.93. That is, there were 5.93 candidates for each post. And you can see that the competition has been gradually increasing. And I had a look through this. I found out that the posts for dermatologies are actually decreasing and the number of candidates are increasing as well. I'm not really sure why the posts are decreasing, but this is the case. The salaries of the dermatology consultants is around 84,559 pounds per year before taxes and 
this can go up to 114,000 pounds per year before taxes while you're working in the NHS. When you are a trainee, your salary is around 28,800 to 33,300 pounds per year during core training and it increases to at least 39,467 pounds per year while you are in your specialty training program. So that is all for dermatology training. I hope that I was able to clear your doubts. I was able to present dermatology training pathway in detail to you. If you have any further questions, comment down in the comment section and I'll be very happy to answer those queries for you. Please subscribe to this channel. Please share this video. Please like this video and I will see you soon. Thanks a lot for watching.